After a devastating blow for his family, one former Oklahoma sheriff deputy says going back into law enforcement and doing what he loves makes him feel better. Austin Brissett explains why. Yes, we do. Oh, I'm so glad you're back. Me too. Making the rounds in his old stomping grounds. Yeah, that was a little while ago. All you guys done went and grew up. The kids call him Deputy Dan, short for Deputy Daniel McCain. Joining the Oklahoma County Sheriff's Office in 2006, he eventually became a resource officer at Oklahoma Christian School before joining the military and getting deployed back in 2017. Taking his place at that time, his oldest brother, Jeremy. Jeremy actually had followed every step of my law enforcement career, especially even in the jail. If I got promoted, he filled that, that space behind me. Back in March, Jeremy's car hit one of the gates in the OCS parking lot, sending him to the hospital. He later died. It's been an emotional roller coaster, um, but I, I'm doing well now. While his brother was in the hospital, Daniel says he started having conversations about coming back and doing what he loved most, being in law enforcement. The sheriff's office kind of said, you know, why don't you just put in an application and see what happens. And it, that's it's oh, yeah. kind of just a mutual I'll thing, and it that. really worked out. So having him back is just fantastic. It's um, very surreal this morning to have him back on campus. Now he's back walking the halls and seeing several familiar faces. I know again. Law enforcement is my home. Being a school resource officer is just, it's part of me. And while the tragic death of his brother still stings, McCain says he just wants to continue their legacy and honor him. You know, I'm not really for sure how to describe the impact that he has had, but it's something that, uh, you know, I hope that I can come close to be able to do. Y'all have a great day. I'll see y'all soon, okay? Building those relationships, bridging that gap between, you know, the youth and law enforcement.